Why should I learn touch typing? Lots of people can type quickly using just two fingers. You might be one of them. Like with any skill, typing with just two fingers takes practice. And the more you practice, the faster you will get. So why would you bother learning how to type with all ten fingers? The bottom line is, in a head-to-head -head competition, even the fastest hunt and peck typist will never be able to type as quickly as someone who's making use of all ten of their digits. But what is hunt and peck typing? Hunt and peck typing is when you use one finger from each hand, usually the index or middle fingers, to hunt for keys on the keyboard. Generally, this involves looking away from the computer screen in order to look down at the keyboard to type a word. So what is touch typing? According to the Oxford Dictionary, touch typing is the practice or skill of typing using all one's fingers and without looking at the keys. This is learned over time with correct instruction and regular practice with two hands and all ten fingers. Typing Efficiency Hopping from one key to the next with the same finger is almost like trying to pedal a bike with one leg. You can get pretty quick with one foot, but you'll never be as fast as if you were using both your feet. With hunt and peck, you might move your index finger across the whole keyboard just to find the letter you need, which is slow and tiring. With touch typing, each finger has its home key on the keyboard layout where it rests when it's not typing, and each key on the keyboard is assigned a finger. If you keep your fingers on the home row and only move the necessary finger, you're guaranteed to go faster than if you're moving your whole hands and wrists around the keyboard. Muscle Memory In spite of its name, muscle memory isn't stored in your muscles. It's stored in a part of your brain called the cerebellum. When you learn a new movement, your brain creates a memory of the pieces that make up that movement and stores it in your cerebellum. Scientists call this motor learning. When your fingers know where to go automatically, it's very relaxing and efficient. Repetition strengthens your brain's memory of the right way to perform the task and stamps the results into muscle memory. Thus, the more repetitions you perform, the better that your brain learns the movement. Put simply, the more you practice, the stronger your muscle memory will be. Typing without looking at the keyboard engages all four brain hemispheres. Every time you type, you're teaching your fingers habits, good or bad. It's better to learn to touch type now to avoid training the brain to learn how to hunt and peck the keys and then having to unlearn it later. Creating good habits takes practice. Remember as you type to use your home row, look up at your screen instead of down at your keyboard and you will be on the path to becoming a great touch typer. Created using Powtoon.